Hey. So uh, I decided I want to hop on the bandwagon a little bit here with regards to Dragon's Dogma 2 Character Creator. If you have watched any of my long plays on the series, you will know that, uh, you know, it's not unusual me. It's not unusual me. I guess I am. <laughs> unusual for me, rather, to spend probably a little too long in character creation. You know, I'm not alone in that fact. People do that, so leave me alone. Don't yuck my yum. Uh, so, for some reason, this game has given us the ability to... Uh, create your character beforehand. Uh, I'm not really sure why necessarily, but it's interesting. And I, I think you can even import it to the game afterwards. Uh, from what I've read, that seems to be the case. Uh, so, you know, that's sort of interesting. Um, I don't think I'll necessarily do that because I'll probably, when the time comes, uh, just actually do it again. And, and plus, I, I saw somewhere that there'll be maybe more options or something. So... Um, that being said, I do want to, you know, take a crack at it. It's just for poops and giggles, and I thought I would record it, because it's fun to do that sort of thing. Uh, so we're going to be making the librarian, the titular, in terms of the channel, librarian, <laughs> uh, who I always try to make look like uh, Giles from Buffy. Uh, let me just show you what that is if I can capture uh, what monitor is that smart selection how would I just do this oh it did work okay so let's see what we're dealing with here so this is who I'm going to try to make whether that is possible or not, <laughs> time has shown from past episodes, it's not necessarily that possible. I mean, I come, uh, I, I capture the spirit, let's say. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to have this up on a, another monitor as I hop into this. Why is it so small? I mean, not on your screen, it's not. But on my, my, for some reason, I can't go larger. I can't change. Maybe once I get in, I can. Uh, okay. Oh. Barely. Uh, yeah. Pattern. I don't even see anything there. Oh, wow. Interesting. On the, huh, in the record versus what I see. <laughs> That's interesting. It's quite a bit brighter in the record than it is on what I see. I think it's maybe because I've adjusted the brightness on my TV, which I use as a monitor. Okay, so for me, it's just barely visible. But for you, it's quite a bit visible. <laughs> okay, I'll do that then. Uh, just until the picture in the center disappears. Okay. All right. For me, it's disappeared. For you, it's still a little visible. It's fine. Autosave. <laughs> okay, now can I change the resolution? Because I'm playing in a small window for some reason. Uh, I should probably also... Change the volumes loud AF. Yeah, that's better. <laughs> uh huh. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. Oh, full screen. Okay, yeah, that's better. Graphics memory. Processing load? What do those mean? Um, it did say you should play with a controller, which is interesting. I've never seen a game actually say, you know, we recommend you play with a controller. Uh, 
I'm not going to, but it's interesting. Uh, so I did purchase, which, you know, I was a little reticent to, I don't mind necessarily pre-purchasing some games. Um, this one I was a little reticent just because I didn't play actually the first one. So uh, my knowledge of Dragon's Dogma is, let's say, limited. Um, but I've heard good things, and a friend of mine who we have very similar taste in games has spoken highly of it, and uh, it seems like it'll lend itself well to a future long play series. So I didn't mind too much. Oh, okay. So that might be good then. I'll use this and then just sort of edit. What I often do in my long play series is character creation and like the first initial section of a game, like before you sort of hop in to main stuff, I guess. Well, it sort of depends. Um, I'll treat that as like a, a an episode to itself because not everyone wants to see character creation. I understand. Here I am doing. Huh. Okay. Oh, ooh, uh, can I make, okay, well, I, I'm interested in this now, I didn't know this was a thing, so I could try to make, like, one of my old characters that I've traveled with, say, from Skyrim, like, can I make the luggage, that would be cool, can I make the professor, Ella the Huntress, my wife, we'll see, we'll see, um, no, oh, great, no, please, please. Choose a race, body type, and base head. <laughs> base head. Uh, further edits. What's finalized? Can, oh, just the race. Okay. So. Oh, like cat people? Okay, I guess human. Oh, what's with the scar? Just. Hmm. Rotate. Let's get a look at the junk in this trunk. Pretty good. Um, okay, so he's tall. That might be it, but not like muscular tall. Um, or just sort of like normal. Whoops. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. How do I go back? Yes. Okay, so this is just like short. Like, what is this? I, I, I need reference to <laughs> what these are. Maybe that one. Maybe just normal dude. But is that like short? I don't know, man. Uh, I think that might be too tall and skinny. Just sort of like a normal dude, man. Okay, we'll do this one. Okay. Ideally, I mean, wow. <laughs> I almost feel like the, the very first one is going to be a good base start. Okay, let's just see if any jump out at me. That's particularly Gilesy. Uh, maybe with some tweaking. That's not too bad. Okay, I think that's in the lead. So that was page four. Um. Yeah. What? Base head two of three. Oh, I see. Um, can I get rid of the hair after, though? Or right, like the beard? Probably, right? 
Oh wait, what is alt? Uh, no. Oh wait. Yes. What? Back. Oh my god. What have I done? Uh, maybe I should try a controller. Alright. Just because it recommends and maybe it'll be easier. <laughs> He's got kind of floomfy, slightly floomfed hair. Is it, is it slicked back? Yeah, it's kind of slicked back. Okay. I've selected the base would you yes. <coughs> oh. oh you know what I can get real though. It's 170. <laughs> let's just see if I can do this. Uh it's gonna take a oh okay, you know what? I'll do it from my phone. I'll have to figure out that if I ever do the actual series. I can't alt tab out, it seems like. I think it's because I'm in full screen, but not full screen windowed. Okay, so were I to say... Uh, how tall is Anthony Stewart Head? Because that's the actor's name. Five foot six. Oh, he's kind of short. Five foot six in centimeters. 167. Okay. Oh. Forgot. Um, okay, so how do I go? Confirm. 167 torso length. <laughs> I don't know, a normal amount. Type 2. Type 4. Oh my god, how many types of muscles? I mean, no offense to the actor, but he doesn't seem incredibly muscular. And as a general sort of rule, The uh, librarian prefers to use his brains over his uh, brawn. Okay, so that's body. Good. Um, head size. <laughs> that would be tempting. Slightly bigger. That's fine, that's fine. Yeah, what about like actual face stuff? Is that like next? Okay, good, good. Because he doesn't have a beard. Uh, so head's fine, upper body. Yeah, give him some shoulders. Sure. 
hourglass. Oh, literal, literal arm length. Oh, you can get a little freaky with this, I bet, eh? <laughs> Papa. Uh, lower body. <laughs> yep. Yep. Alright. Yeah, the librarian famously has a dumper. Okay, normal walk. What do we got here? Movement style. Um... seeing like a huge difference I guess posture yeah. <laughs> that looks like is it Vince McMahon who walks up walks in like that um, I kind of wouldn't mind if he had a dumb walk dumb Vince mcmahon -y walk I gotta swing those arms more Or is it uh, that MMA guy? I forget his name. How come my weight went down? Oh, is that because of uh, changes I made? Yeah. <laughs> That's a dumb walk, and I'm here for it. All right. <laughs> yeah, cranked up. Uh, all right. Head. Uh, no. Um, what about hair? Is that next? Yeah, okay. Uh, you know what? I should do hair first, and then I'll better be able to judge. So facial hair. How do I zoom in? I'm guessing... Z None. All right. The face is definitely not quite right. Oh, uh. Zoom. Oh, I zoom. Hairstyle. So six is okay. All oh, right, trigger. <laughs> Jeez, hello. Um, oh, no. Oh. Oh, it's nice that you can put the uh, female hair on a dude. I, was, I mean, why not let you do that, right? Hmm. It's going to be funny if we just stay with the same one. Although, that's pretty good. Because he's got kind of a big forehead. Okay, so 18. <laughs> Hey, Mo. Uh, 18 or 6, I believe. Um, no, I 
think it's 18. Yeah. Uh, color. So it is. Where's like gray? Oh, that's actually pretty good right there. Um, it's got like, you know, I don't know how, is that mousy? Is that how you would describe? It's not horrible. Uh, I need... That's pretty good. Sheen position. Um, it's not horrible. So I could put a little, uh, a little gray at the temples would be nice. Uh, I kind of got it. All right, all right. We'll we'll consider that somewhat accurate. Eyebrows, eyebrows, they're a little thinner. Yeah. None. <laughs> Not incredibly pronounced, but they do exist. Facial hair now, body hair. I don't know if we ever see him with his shirt off. No, uh, I kind of don't think he's a body hair guy. All right, so head, skin color, we're actually good. Uh, maybe like a little, <laughs> just a little darker. Okay, so not that. Uh, 12, I think it's good. Wow, 40 different ones, eh? Um, he's got like a little red to him. So, yeah. it's funny, uh, I feel like on a few of these, uh, like, just what I accidentally landed on is close to what it should be. Eight, nine, fourteen, fifteen, that looks good. Wrinkles. He's got a few. Sheen. <laughs> no, thank you. I'll tell you what, give me four Sheen. All right. Uh, we're going to get the chin, I think, would help. Um, oh, there's no uh, cleft. Cleft positioning. Hmm. 
just sort of doing a... And this is what I normally do, even though I feel like it kind of doesn't necessarily work. Is just look at the picture, do the sliders like super quick. You know what I mean? Like, does this look more like him or less like him? More like him, less like him. Um, what was the length, I think, down a bit? Hmm. Yeah, let's <coughs> Let just move this out of the way. Uh oh. Did that break it? Oh. I'm back in windowed mode. And you know what? Okay, and when I click in it, it's going to go to full screen. Yes, that is what has happened, which is fine. Um, yeah, none of these shots, these pictures I'm looking at are great in terms of... Uh, no shots. I don't, I don't got a great no shot, I will admit. Um, brow, height, actually, yeah, brow spacing, sure. Kind of make them like happy looking or mischievous. Well, that's kind of sad. Oh, it'll be okay, but we don't want him angry either. Bend. Yeah. That's okay, that's okay. Um, mouth, a little smaller. Oh, eyes. Uh, as I would like depth um I mean it doesn't have small eyes <laughs> yeah is, is one of his eyes squinty I don't know <laughs> it is here uh, nose I did, ears, what do we got ear-wise? A little smaller. Jeez, okay, um, yeah. Wow, if, I, if anything I would say he's got like small ears. Yeah, let's sort of tuck back a bit. Tilt. No tilts. Tips. Just the tips. Um, he, the librarian has been a half elf in quite a few realms. Maybe we leave him pointing as a nod to that. No. Lobes. What are his lobes like? Uh, he's not lobeless, but he doesn't have big lobes. Look, uh, you know, I, I feel like I've done worse. <laughs> I've done worse. Uh, yeah, 
he's got pretty high cheekbones. I think. Mouth gonna be a little smaller. Yeah, that's pretty good. <laughs> Thick thickness. I just wish I could put a cleft in it. That would uh, that would help a lot. Okay, so let's hair, makeup, um, teeth makeup. <laughs> that is cool. I mean, he has all his teeth, so. <laughs> I do not like that smile. I will say that. Um, yeah, not really any distinguishing marks. <laughs> Luscious lashes. Too luscious. Uh, tattoo. I think he actually does have a tattoo, doesn't he? Tattoo presets, body tattoos. Should we give him a tattoo? If we can find like a book related one, maybe. Something that reminds us of books. Um, he did have a tattoo or tattoos when uh, he was... Okay, that's it. Eh? And how do I... I don't want a tattoo. Reset. Okay, thank you. Dirt. No, he's a very clean individual. Scar. Okay, yeah. Anything that screams like books. Oh, just some writing might be cool. 26. Yeah, just like a book. 32. Yeah, maybe we do pick a tattoo. Not necessarily going chest one, but... Jeez, there's a lot of them. Some of these are kind of weird. Like, why would you get this? All right, so maybe no, how about arm? Are they just the same ones? Mm, I think it's just the same ones. Yeah, it is. Okay, so let's just do some writing. And... You know what? We'll do a nod to his... Um, it's more blue. Yeah, sort of that color. 
So in uh, when you did have a bunch of tattoos, because you kind of had to, you they just your character had them in Diablo Four. Uh, like everything he like wore, even like his skeleton, you know, summons and stuff were all sort of the sort of blue color. <laughs> you do just a little teeny one. Eh, I was kind of happy with the original size. Sheen, put some more sheen on it. Yeah. Alright. That's okay. Uh, anything else? No. We'll just do that. Should we give him Asgar? Let's just see what the options are. Jeez, a little. <laughs> Only reason I wouldn't mind a scar because we just give him like a real. Like, what would I do? I would do like that one or do that one. That's where his. Uh, how do I zoom out again? Yeah. And we just like never mention it. Scar. Except for the obvious one that is probably story related or something, I would assume. Um, okay, so we're good. Close and save. Close your character and return to the title screen. A temporary save will be created. Oh. Um. No. How do I, like, finish? Finalize. Oh. Um, body, base, uh, detailed customization. What this? Oh, that's what that is. Um, probably going to be a mage. He's He's sort of a mage thief, to be honest, but... That hair is not quite right. It's going to be lighter. Well, in some pictures it's dark and some it's light. Well, you know, that's that's pretty good. Uh, yeah, I would probably go mage. It's because I tend to have fun with mage. I like magic. Magic is fun. Curative magics. Yeah. Okay. Voice. Um. Oh. How do I? Oh, there it is. <laughs> but that might be a girl. Where are these all? Oh, do you not talk in this game? Uh, <laughs> a lot of these... We're done. There you go. Meet the librarian. 
it's not great in terms of looking like Giles. However, good enough. Oh, um. Ooh, can I fit? That'll be a question. Uh, Oh my god. That's not the first time that's happened. Uh, okay, so we're only one letter off, so we're not going to have to do T-Lib like we did in uh, Persona 5. The Librarian. Alright. Yeah. That'll, uh, that'll do. Confirm. Um, moniker? Oh. What does this mean? Alfonso? Oh, uh, is Giles one? <laughs> Fang, fairy? Oh, wait, yeah, what are these? Just see if Giles is one. Gil? Glitch. Gold. Or the gold? Oh, how about book? Bear. Billy. <laughs> Bo. Bobo. Booker. Probably Booker. <laughs> Booker. Booker. Yeah, he's a, that's a, just another word for a librarian, basically. A booker. All right. Uh, yeah. Uh, okay. I'm happy with that. Uh, when you create, you will be given an option to use existing data. Yeah. Maybe when I get in there, I'll, uh, try to uh, adjust them to make them a little better and i also feel like you know in most games you don't see your character too too much <laughs> i guess baldur's gate my my guy looked a little weird um i did manage to get the cleft chin though okay so let's do that other thing what was it the main pot oh yeah my buddy Okay, 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 okay. Create new. So ideally, I wouldn't mind the luggage. Or... And I wouldn't mind a cat person, just so we have a little different. Whatever the hell's going on here. Yeah, should I get the luggage? The only reason the luggage might be nice is because he was my first companion. And then we have the librarian and the luggage. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so the luggage, we need, like, short and stout. Here's my handle. Here's my spout. Yeah. Um, and we're going to get sort of... Things we're looking for is square and gold. <laughs> uh, if you're unfamiliar, the luggage is from the Discworld series, and it's like a sentient ambulatory uh, like treasure chest looking thing that's usually uh, at least in Skyrim it was like a dwarven chest with like legs and like would walk around and follow me all right let's say this is a good base yeah we'll say that's a good base oh yeah Yes, I do want to customize it. Okay, this is going to be fun because... Um, <laughs> we really get to, like, go crazy. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay, okay, okay. No. Yes, yes. 
muscles. Kind of hard to tell on this individual. That's fine. Uh, lower body. Yeah, I want that. That. Obviously, legs. Thighs. <laughs> All right, slightly chest like. I was hoping to make um, his legs shorter, though. I'd like him to be squatter if possible, but maybe not an option. Uh, upper body. Thick boy. Um, no. Yes. Crank that up. Uh, if we do have a choice, I guess we'll see. If I can, um make him like more of a martial character <laughs> this is gonna be pretty good because i mean he's definitely giving me i've made the luggage in a few things and i feel like this is maybe the closest um, so far. So he should sort of like skitter. If possible. But I don't really know how. Yeah, he doesn't move his arms too much. No. Let's keep it like, keep your movements small. <laughs> All right, and he'll be the opposite. I'm walking like that, he's walking like this. Because he's my minion, right? <laughs> All right, did I just snort there a little? Maybe. Um. Okay, yeah, now fur. Oh, he looks sad. <laughs> He's giving me, like, uh, please kill me vibes. Oh, okay. Um, yeah, just that. Oh, these are presets? Okay, well, uh, let's go back to the first one since it was close-ish but oh um I'm looking for gold Reset fur. Is that what it was? Okay. So no presets. Yeah, that's pretty good. Uh, he was sort of the color of, at least in Skyrim. Like dwarven stuff or dwemer stuff. That sort of gold, bronze, brown. It's too black. Mm. Oh, yeah. Okay, okay, okay. We're getting somewhere. We're getting places, we're getting places, I swear to God. 
Oh no, I don't want a pattern. But fuzzy. Ugh, it's, it hurts my eyes to look at. That's perfect. shiny gold basically <laughs> look at this fucking guy that's not the worst that's not the worst thing I've ever seen I mean, <laughs> in some regards, it's the worst thing I've ever seen. I just wish the... Like, it, it seems to, like, go black instead of brown. I wish it went more brown. All right, well... That's, like, okay. And it's insane looking. So for that reason, I'm in. <sighs> Hid. I already did base. Um, squish it in. Sure. Eyes. Get those eyes low. Close together? No, nope. far apart. Depth. Push them way back in there. Size. Huge. Angle. Whatever. Um, left eye closed. Yeah. So he's mocking my slightly squinted left eye. <laughs> ears give some big old ears that's like the handles on the side of the chest ah. right that makes a sort of sense Cheeks, chubby. <laughs> Neck fat, bulbous. Cheek heights. Not much of a difference. Depth. Mouth. Bring that baby way up. Wide AF. Corners. Smiling, he's, he's happy. Lower lip. Oh. You know what? Okay, he doesn't look like he wants to die anymore. So I'm happy with that. <laughs> Not sharp. Alright. Hairstyle. Oh, uh, okay, yeah, so we need, like, a round, or a square or something. <sighs> Actually, I think that's how I did it in Baldur's Gate. Baldur's Gate 2. Uh, just, like, no hair. Okay, so I'll do no hair, unless one of these really screams luggage, which... <laughs> For a hair to scream luggage, uh, that's sort of tempting. Oh. Mm. 
I think maybe no air. That one was tempting just because it was kind of square. Yeah, no hair. Cool. Facial hair? Maybe ditto. Yeah, I'm thinking that. Yep. No questions. No questions asked. Definitely that. Makeup. Mm hmm. Hmm. None of those really jumped out at me. Oh. Reset makeup. Uh, nose color, no eyes, maybe. Oh, that's just like eye color. All right, that's fine. Oh, uh, cancel eyelashes. Let's give him big lashes. Oh, there they are. Okay, that's fine. Teeth. No teeth. <laughs> He's toothless. <laughs> yep. Um. Can't really see the claws. Oh yeah, okay. Yeah. Kind of looks like a teddy bear too. Which I did have a teddy bear traveling with me for a brief time, but he was very annoying. Um Yeah. I don't think any of this is going to be what we're looking for. <laughs> no. Um. Okay. I think that's good, though. <laughs> Hello. Hello, the luggage. <laughs> Looks like he's mumbling to himself. That is pretty good, to be honest. Uh, this makes me want to play the game more. We're running around with this guy? Come on. Um, no. Okay, I think we're done. Oh, wait. What was that button? That was the wrong button. This button. Uh, okay. Let's uh, Beastrin. Interesting. Okay, so he's going to be a fighter. Should he be a thief? Um, no. I like a big fightery type if I'm going to be a mage. Uh, yeah, kind of hard. Yeah. Mm. I don't know if I need them to be. Straightforward. Can I just... Or is he calm? Yeah. Um. Test voice. The people here are evacuated and safe. For the moment. Oh, you know what? The people here are evac. There are more who can yet be saved. The people here are evacuated and safe. 
And then what is interesting about this is the people here are 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 it seems the rain has abated there are more who can the people here are there are more who can the people here are evacuated and safe former arisen appear to be plentiful in this world uh is the luggage didn't have a voice in uh Skyrim because well he was luggage <laughs> and I guess whoever made the mod didn't Give him a voice. Well, he didn't have a voice in Discworld, so that sort of makes sense. Um, all right. Okay, can I fit the luggage? The luggage. Oh, sure, that fits. Yeah, that's how you spell luggage, right? <laughs> I'm always very careful because uh, you... Luggage. It's two Gs, isn't it? Okay, the luggage. Uh, should I get rid of? You know what? I'm gonna. I'll tell you what. If I don't get a space, you're not getting a space. The luggage. Um. Oh. Okay. What would be good for the luggage? I don't suppose luggage would be one of them. Lance a lot. Be weird if it was. Lucky, lucky luggage. Lulu luggage. Luther luggage. Okay. Um, I'll tell you what. What about luggage? Sin. Baggage, bag, gear, Babs, Barry, oh, Billy, Bog, uh, hmm. Okay, let's do an L, something with L, something alliterative. Lady Luggage, Languid, Lancelot, Larry, Lord Louder, Lord Lee, Leek, Leo. Leo? He's a cat. Okay, Leo's in the Leonard, Leonidas, Leoris. Okay, so far we'll go Leo. Unless anything else. Lion. Lion Luggage? Lionel? Lionel. He kind of looks like a Lionel. Okay, Lionel. We'll go Lionel. Unless anything else. L Lucky, I didn't mind, to be honest. Lucky luggage. Lulu. Yeah, we'll go Lionel luggage. It's a lit a literative, and he's also kind of looks like a D&D &D Lionel. Minus the main, I guess. Cool. All right, I guess that's sort of going to do it for us, folks. Uh, yeah, clocking in at an hour. <laughs> that's about my uh, my sort of often default character creation time, an hour. Yeah, not too unusual that I would spend that amount of time, believe it or not. Uh, if you watch this, thanks. You got to see a little of... Uh, teeny little the tippity top of the game at least that's something and uh potentially where we're going uh when i do record a long play which is the game plan at some point at some point um i, I yes uh, on that note so fallout 4 i got finish and then i was gonna do bioshock next but now i'm debating if i should do bioshock or dragon's dogma I don't know. I'm going to sort of play that by ear and, you know, just check out the channel and you'll know what happens when and who and why and how, I guess. I'm rambling now, which means I should just say it's nice to be nice to the nice.